Salut à tous, my name is Marion Buricatu. I am a French artist and I lived here in the United States since 2001. This video is about art and how to impress your friends and family at the museum with three easy facts. So, why is the painting called Le Thé, which means in English the tea? by Mary Cassatt so interesting? Well, it's because I want to show you some of the technical tools that she used to build her painting. So here are the three facts. Fact number one, it's an impressionist painting. Fact number two, it's about leading the eye of a viewer. And fact number three, it's about texture and pattern. So here is the painting, Le Thé by Mary Cassatt. It was painted in 1880 and this painting is, that, is at the Museum of Fine Art in Boston. Fact number one, an impressionist painting. Why? Why is this painting an impressionist painting? Because it's about her modern world. And if I want you to remember one thing about impressionism, that's what it is. It's about modern subject and modern world. Before, paintings were rarely about the modern subject. Here is a painting by William Bouguereau. Um, it's called Nymph and Satire. It was painted in 1873 and it's at the Clark Institute in Massachusetts. The subject is mythology. So what was a modern subject in 1880? It was the mundane action of everyday life, like drinking a cup of tea. This was the focal point of this painting. So, as you can see on the painting Le Thé, the characters were fashionable clothing, trendy new wallpaper, gilded mirror, the fabric of the chair. And as you can see, she's raising the pinky finger while sipping the tea. So now, what would be a modern subject in 2018? I think that we can safely assume it would be a painting of a group of people texting. So now, fact number two, leading the eye of the viewer. So, using my photo editor on my computer or my phone, this is what I did. I modified the painting in three black and white values, which means that I have the darkest value, they are black. I have the lightest value, they are white, and the medium value are gray. No more color, just white, black, and gray. When she did the prep work for this painting, she certainly did some preparatory sketches only in black and white to see how she was moving the eye of the viewer. And you can see the movement of the light values leading the eyes towards the sipping of the cup. Now, fact number three, textures and patterns. This time, using my photo editor, I modify the painting in only two values, only black and white, no more gray. And you can see now on this image that she used repetitive oval shapes like cups, saucers, trays, hats, and faces. They offset the strict graphic geometry of the stripped wallpaper the floral design of the chair and the swirls of the chimney and mirror. Notice also the plain dark masses of the clothes. By using pattern and texture, she leads the viewer towards the focal point, the drinking of the tea. So here are the three facts. Easy to remember about the painting Le Thé by Marie Cassatt. Fact number one, it's an impressionist painting. Fact number two, it's about leading the eyes of a viewer. And fact number three, it's about texture and pattern. Now, if you want to impress even more your friends and family at the museum, the next video is just for you because I have created seven trivia questions. Also, if you just want to learn more about Marie Cassatt and this painting in particular, please check out the link below. Nice chatting with you, abonne-toi, which means subscribe to my channel. Have fun and see you at the next video.